I'm Marcy Dagman, the aspiring gardener, and today we're going to talk about saving flower seeds. Now, most of the time we collect our seed at the end of summer when the seed is ripe and it starts to turn brown. And what I have here is a head of an echinacea plant, a purple cone flower. Some of the seeds falling off in the bags, nice and dry. And as you can see here, the cone itself is the seed. So um, even though I didn't have a lot of time to do anything with it at the time, I made sure that it was thoroughly dry before I put it away and I stuck it in this plastic bag. But what I really like to do is remove the seed, get it all off of there. And this is nice and dry. Don't ever try to store moist seed. That's th that'll mold and you'll lose all of your seed. So even if you have to leave it on the screen or on the paper towel or whatever it is you're using to dry it, leave it a long time. Most of the time, if you've got it on a stem like this, you could even lay it in a basket like this and just leave it to dry in a room. But make sure that it's thoroughly dry because that'll be your first mistake if there's any moisture in the seed at all. So another thing you can do if you're not quite sure but you feel like it's dry is you can store it in an envelope with that paper taking up that little bit of extra moisture. And another thing I like about envelopes is I can write on it the name and the date. But most of the time, if you have any amount of seed, that's going to get kind of monotonous. So the usual vessel is a airtight jar. So what I'm going to do with this seed, because it is definitely dry, I'm not worried about that. I'm going to put it in this jar. Now the darker the jar, the better. Um, you can use the clear or a blue one like this, or even better, if you have the brown jars, they're the best. Because what will cause your seed to degrade is light and moisture. The other thing you want to do is keep them cool. If it's too warm, some of your seed might fail. So the best thing to do is just put it in an airtight container like this, find a nice dark cupboard, Put it in there, leave it over the winter, and then come spring, you can plant your seed. 